What's up, agents? Jetforth here, and in today's wonderful video, I am going to show you guys how to open up the secret loot room in the Coney Island Amusement Park mission. This room is located right after your very first encounter. Very hard to miss. This is the door right here that we are going to open, and you will notice that there are two red wires coming out, one to the left and one to the right. You will want to start first with whacking a mole. Looks like that's all you're going to be doing today, fat boy. Wow, thanks Scuba Steve. What a nice guy. Happy Valentine's Day everybody! So I'm not sure if there's any specific order that you have to shoot the moles in. I went from a right to left. After you shoot the very last mole, you will hear a little jingle. That means you have successfully completed it. After that, you will want to go over to the right and shoot all the ducks. And once you're finished with that, you will hear that jingle again and the door will open for you. There are two amazingly wonderful loot boxes in there for you. One weapons crate and one armor crate. I know a lot of people don't get too excited for this stuff, but I don't think it would be such a bad idea to know how to get all the loot boxes and whatnot in missions with the update coming on March 3rd because we are going to be getting a lot less loot. So this would be good to know when this place has targeted loot that you are looking looking for. And that pretty much sums it up. Just make sure you start with whack-a-mole first, because I did it once before, starting with the ducks, it made the noise, then I did whack-a-mole and it made the noise, and the door didn't open. The only time it opened when I did it in the opposite order, and that is it. That's all I got. Other than that, I'm trying to decide whether or not I'm going to stream tonight for all of us lonely folk on this wonderful Valentine's Day night. I don't know, let me know if you want to. I might just take it easy, because sitting in this chair for like 10 hours a day for the past few days has been pretty hard on my back so if anybody knows a good cheap chair that's good for your back i'm all ears think cheap though i'm poor anyways that's it hit the old like button for me if you could subscribe and all that other junk and i will catch you all on the flip side peace